Well, I hope you recognize the piece. It's Happy Birthday, of course. And I hope you Googled it. Happy Birthday was originally a song for children called Good Morning to All. It was written by two American sisters, Patty and Mildred J. Hill, in 1893. The lyrics were changed later to the song we know today. The piece is usually sung in F major, and it's always in 3-4 time. The lowest note on our example is a C3, and the highest note is a C4, so the range is one octave. Who cares? Things like that are not relevant to our analysis. Happy Birthday begins on a dotted eighth, sixteenth note figure, and it starts with a pickup. Don't count the pickup when you count how long the piece is. It's eight bars long, not nine. The piece begins on a C, which is the dominant. If you add phrase markings, there are four short phrases. Each one is two bars long, and each phrase begins with a pickup. The second phrase is almost the same as the first. The only difference is that it goes one note higher here. After the dotted eighth sixteenth note figure, there's an interval of a second from C to D in the first two phrases. The third phrase is more dramatic because here it changes. After the dotted eighth sixteenth figure, there is a leap of an octave. Leap means the same thing as jump. The fourth phrase also starts with the same rhythm, but this time it starts on a high B flat, not a low C, and the melody descends. It ends on an F, which is the tonic. <laughs>